Hey guys, my name is Clive and welcome to another video. So today I'm going to show you how to apply the speed ramp effect to your videos. Now this has got to be one of the easiest tutorials that I'm going to make. Not only speed ramp is so easy to use and apply, it's also effective when it comes to editing your videos. All right, let's begin. Let's head over to Filmora 10. All right guys, welcome to Filmora 10. As you can see, I've already got one clip that I have um, put on my timeline. Now this is just basically a continuous clip that I basically cut into five different parts. So we have first cut, second cut, third cut, fourth cut, and a fifth cut. Now, when we apply the speed ramp, there are certain parts of the videos that I wanted to slow down, and there are certain parts of the video that I wanted to speed up. So um, that's why I cut the video into five different parts. So to break this down, and I don't want to complicate things, the first video will be a normal speed, the second video will be a slow-mo clip, the third clip will be a fast clip, the fourth clip will be another slow-mo and the fifth clip will be a normal speed. All right, the first thing you need to do on the first clip, you're just gonna leave it as a normal speed. And then the second clip will be a slow-mo. So go to speed, go to slow and apply 0.5 speed. The third clip again is a fast speed. So go to speed, apply fast and then apply two times speed. And then the fourth clip will be a slow-mo. So go to um, slow and then apply 0.5 speed. And again, the fifth clip will be a normal speed. All right guys, a simple tip for you. Um, you don't necessarily have to follow what I've just done here. You can basically um, create your own editing style or create your own combination of fast and slow speed. It really depends upon on your editing style and how the video would look for you. So it's all about your, your style and your creativity. So what I'm showing you here is just basically an example on how you could create your own speed rant. All right, so you don't necessarily have to follow what I show you here. I just want you to enjoy, do your own creative stuff and enjoy the editing process. All right, guys, we are done. That's how easy and how quick you're going to apply the speed ramp effect to your videos. Once again, this has been Clive and I hope you enjoyed this video and I shall see you next time. Bye.